Everyone's going back to the Paleoretic era because they want to build anything from scratch. But here's the uncomparable question. Why are you reinventing the wheel when the car already exists? You're not a developer. You don't know code. Why are you spending three weeks building a social media automation that Twitter Hunter does in three clicks? This is the fake developer trap and it's killing your business. In the next 25 minutes, I will show you why AI educators want to stop building instead of growing and three steps fundamental that actually grows platforms. Fundamental never change. And live proof, me growing Twitter to 10,000 followers in 30 days using tools, not any then. Went to automate it versus went to buy the damn tool. I was scrolling Twitter, yeah, and I only have nine followers. <laughs> we'll get to that. And I see all these AI automation experts teaching how to scrap Twitter with N8N, organize view and Airtable, auto schedule post and generate content, cloud API, blah, 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 very noisy content. And I'm thinking, why? Every platform already has gross tools. For example, YouTube have a TubeBuddy and VidIQ and Twitter have a Twitter Hunter or, v or Hype Fury. LinkedIn have a Tap Leo. Yeah, these tools already exist. They are 20 to $50 a month, but instead you're watching six hours tutorials on how to build things with NADN. Spending 40 plus hours breaking it every week or, and calling yourself an automation expert after consuming big Sareb content like I was this one. Six hours content and I have to spend at least 40 hours to master this. And this is a real course. Let's do the math. Building Twitter automation with NADN, 40 hours learning, 20 hours building workflows and 10 hours debugging. Very painful parts and maintenance five hours a month and total 75 hours but if you use a tweak hunter like already built gross tool only 30 minutes setup and 50 dollars a month that works immediately and the first month only you need a minute this is a truth and you can 74 hours save at 50 dollars per hour value that's the three thousand dollar you just wasted to save 50 and here's the kicker while you were building, someone using Twit Hunter already grew to 10,000 followers. And let me show you something nobody talks about. I watch this AI automation educators on YouTube. How to actually scrap Twitter data with NADN. Automate Twitter with NADN. This AI agent just automate this 500,000 view Twitter threads. And I notice a pattern. They are not teaching you to grow your business. They are teaching you to become tool built. Because if they taught you the fundamentals, find the top performers, still like an artist, and then do a massive volume. This is the point. And then you'd be done one video. But teaching you NADN, that's 100 plus video. And multiple courses, community membership, school, hell, ongoing updates when tools change. You stay a student forever. They make money forever. Yeah, this is the uncomfortable truth. So I want to say, do not build a custom scrapper and create complex automation and learning API and debug workflows. You don't need anything. But this, find the top performers in your field, still like an artist, their content structure, and do massive volume for three months. That's it. You don't need this kind of automation service, to be honest. I'm a big fan of automation, but you never made it at first time if you don't know that industry winning formula for your own so here's three step fundamental that actually works i have nine twitter followers right now my personal friends and but i'm not worried because i know the fundamental and the fundamental is same on every platform youtube where I have 40,000 subscribers, and Twitter, where I have nine right now, or LinkedIn, where I'll be next. The winning process never change. Only three steps. Step one, find the top performers. Search your niche, find the people with engagement, not just follow, and then save their 20 best performing pieces from the last six months. We'll call this winning structure. For me, on Twitter, AI automation builder, indie hackers, building public people or execution focused account. They are my target. My time in best, five hours, to be honest, not a five, only one hour. Use Tweet Hunter. I use Tweet Hunter at this time to analyze top posts. And I don't organize to research. Because if you don't have enough data, don't need to tracking 
called data. Some of people, data is really important. Yeah, I agree. I totally agree. I, I'm a very data-driven thinking person. But at the first time, you don't have a thousand plus data. You don't need to tracking. Simple. I wrote down this post before and I'm going to explain this concept. Iterate as much as possible. Try as many offers as possible. Do not track bullshit only. Right? When you something start working, you will know definitely. If it wasn't an extra two replies, it will be 20 paying customers. You can worry about metrics after your first 100 customers and scale up a winning offer as fast as possible with, with as many entrepreneurs as possible. So do not tracking at the first time. Do passive action. No NAD complex research. That's it. After this top performer, after this research step, go to step two. Still like an artist. Okay, I mean, this is not a copy. Tweak 10% structure. Only 10%. You have to follow their hook tone. What hooks do they use and what format get engagement? For example, performance tweet, I made $10,000 in 30 days. We just, I validate X in three days, in 30 days. Here's exactly how thread. Or I'm going to show you my lead after this section. And you can use cloud code. This is my prompt. First template. First, this is a winning post. You wouldn't book a call with your either. And cloud will change this. You wouldn't join execution squad with your either. I can't get a customers. Nobody buys for me. Like this, these two exactly same structure and same tone and manners, same hook but different context. Yeah, and then go to the massive volume. Post three acts per day is minimum. Every day for 90 days. Track what works and double down on winner. I do 150 action a day. This is truly massive action. Like this massive action, like this, 50 follows and 50 comments and 20 DM and, and 30 likes. Super massive action, but I will done only one hours a day. That's how you grow. Not a connect anything, not by building the perfect automation, not by finding the perfect posting time, just by doing boring work at scale, right? And now I'm going to show you my live session using Tweet Hunter. This is my first time using these tools, but I'd say that winning protocol is simple. Find the winning contents and remix them with your idea using AI and creating 90 content at once and schedule and then send cold DM 20 a day your target people who engage with similar content and if i built this with nadn or make.com i'd spend two weeks learning and four weeks building and five weeks debugging total time 40 plus hours like him and when to actually use nadn nadn isn't bad make.com isn't bad automation isn't bad what's bad is using them to solve problems that are already solved and when nadn actually makes sense only these three times you have a custom workflow nobody else has you are connecting space like our own execution squad data tracking we already have error table and daily check-in and slack alter a refundable trigger this is worth building right now and you are connecting specific tools for your business and the volume justifies the time investment at that time automate it before that time just use already built tool existing tools the problem is common social media scheduling or email marketing analytics and maintenance would be ongoing and your time is worth more than the cost. Most of people, 98% people stay in this area. Before you build anything, ask yourself, does this move me closer to revenue or do it just feel productive? Building a Twitter scrapper feels productive, but it doesn't make a money. Posting 270 tweets in 90 days feels boring, but it grows your platform. I'm going to show you transparency. I'm going to share my 30 days execution plan. Transparency. Like the first week, I will get a 2,000 followers. And three weeks, 5,000. Last weeks, I will get a 10,000 followers. I promise. And I have a confidence using this 150 action a day, I definitely reach these followers. Only spend one hour a day. And tool stack is really simple. Twitter Hunter and Claude, not an API. Google Seed later and Notion. That's the whole thing. Total monthly cost $69. Total time invest 30 hours for an entire month. Compare this to build with NADN. 
maybe 25 or 100 plus hours just for setup. And why this works? Manual first, always. If I built automation first, I'd automate the wrong content and waste time on features I don't need. And by doing manual first, I learned what contents resonate, which hooks convert to followers, and what DM templates get response. When my audience is most active, yeah, that's the data, right? When after 30 days and 10,000 followers, maybe I built custom automation with N8N. Now I know what works. I have a data and the volume justified it. You can't automate what you don't understand. One more time I say it. You can't auto what you don't understand. And then I will be honest, I'm going to create social media text generator automation, text automation using AI and N8N, but I'm making this video first, manual video first, because I want you to understand the order, learn the platform manually, understand what works, get results without automation, then automate the proven process. Yeah, never automate it before you validate. The leader challenge is option one, NA then path. First time, it feels like fast way, but this is most closed way. So don't start another NA then tutorial and build another social media scrapper, another automation tool. You don't need right now. Option B, execution path, two hours on Twitter Hunter setup, post three X daily and 50 DMs daily for 30 days. Learn what actually works, have 10,000 followers in 30 days. So our fundamental, not never change. Pick one platform, find 20 top performers today, create 21 pieces of contents this week, send 50 DMs every day for seven days. So everyone wants to, to go back to the Paleolithic era, building Twitter scrappers when Tweet Hunter exists. You're not a caveman. Stop acting like one. AI didn't change the fundamentals. Find what works, do it at scale. Optimize winners, kill losers. AI just made execution faster if you use it. But if you spend all your time building tools instead of using them, you are slower than before AI existed. You became a fake developer instead of a real business owner. I will document everything. The 270 tweets, the 1,500 DMs, the analytics, the gross, the failures, not because it's sexy, because it's real. Stop reinventing the wheel, start using it to build something that matters. Idea are worthless, execution is everything.